of anything. If you change your mind. Oh, I love that song. <laughs> That's a good one. Who is that? Uh, Abba? No. Who sings it? Yeah, Abba. It's Abba. Abba? <laughs> Beth, what's the song? Mama said to me. Hold on. Who's that? Uh, in the UK, how's Big Brother in the UK? So I'm pretty sure how it works is that the public vote for who I think they want to go home. But I think someone mm -hmm. will pick, like the, I think the house picks? Yeah. Who they want on the block. Okay. And then the public votes. Oh, and that's the same as Australia too, right? Yeah. Uh, okay. But everyone in the house like votes who they want to go on the block. Okay, like so there's no like H O H. No. That's crazy. Is there like a? Can you get off the block if you're nominated? Uh, I think, but I think there's like it's just like challenges. I think it's not like mm -hmm. a veto or anything. Hmm. I like our big brothers better than. Huh? I like our big brothers better. Big Brother That's North America. One. I don't know if they can. Is, oh, is okay. there Big Brother Mexico? Probably. Mexico. Mexico. Is it the added <laughs> okay, one right? this year? <laughs> right? Big so. Brother Switzerland, I think? Yeah. No way. Right. It's the new one, yeah. That's pretty cool. Big That's Brother Switzerland? Cool. Is that what you said? Yeah, the they said OG? that was the brand new one this year. Mm. Damn. If you could add a permanent. Oh, it's brand new? If you could add a permanent twist to Big Brother, what would it be? Like a permanent new rule? A permanent new rule. Probably the invisible HOH. Like, like it's always, always invisible? Always. One a year? Or like always have one. Yeah. <sighs> Be like, is this the invisible HOH coming up? You know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, fair. Mm -hmm. Or like always make it one Jesus week. Jesus, bro. Do you guys think there will you you be absolutely nothing Please? today? Yeah. The guy should be in leggings. I think the HOH should be able to play in the veto. Me too. I, I like that. I actually like that. When they're like, I have all the power in the house, that's cool. Yeah. I want to see Arissa more. You want to see Arissa more? Weekly, like, 15-minute check-in. Somebody making something in here? In the oven? Not me. Not I. It's at 350. Not me. I think that's standard. So maybe someone just accidentally hit it. I don't know. <sighs> yeah, what would you want, Beth? What? If you could add like one rule permanently to Big Brother. Oh. Keep first in invisible HOH every year. I like that. Oh, and like it randomly just pops up? Yeah. yeah. Like it'll always happen every year. Um I said uh HOH can play in the veto. Yeah, I do like that. I think it would be cool if we were all like just sitting together like this and out of nowhere a veto just fell and whoever first got it gets it. It's a war for the yeah, veto. Yeah, it's a war. It'd be a brawl. Like they wait till you're perfectly placed, so it's well, there. Well, I fall on my face, so. <laughs> <laughs> As we see. I think they should do it at night. Everyone's sleeping, and we we'll have to get up. Can you imagine all here's like, ching, ching, and it's like, Yeah, there's drop. like a veto noise, which means it's loose in the house. Stop. We all yeah. go wild. Oh, I'd be in sheer panic. Ties in the ball pit in the dark. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny, Ty. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> I hope they have a fucking... <laughs> <laughs> the fire alarm is going off. <laughs> Oh, it's freezing in here. I also think third place you get some. That's yeah. what I was going to say. Mm -hmm. Top Yo, three? Third place yeah. you get what? Something. Something. Yeah, 10, 25, 1,000. They do third place dirty. Yeah. yeah Even five Gs. Good. Something. <clears throat> like you were about to be, you could have been taken to final two. You yeah. said nothing. And you're salty as hell. Okay, let me, okay, let me ask. People, the, the HOH thought that they couldn't win against you but you get no money, obviously. Or would you rather be taken to final two and lose in second place and know that you're the worst player in that situation, but you take, get 20K? Taken take to second place. Take to second place. Really? I'm not the worst player because I came second. Yeah? Huh? I'm still better because I came second. Or but worse than the third place finisher, right? Like they took you to final two because they think you can, they can beat you, and they do. 
would you rather have second in 20k or would you rather have third and know that you're the better player? I mean, like, would you rather have like the pride of being like I was a better yeah, player? Yeah, is it, so is it like, would you rather have the pride out? of being like the better player or the 20k? I'll no, the 20K. 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 I'm still going to think I'm the better player. <laughs> Literally. 100%. <laughs> 100%. Like, that's just how you see it, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. I've spoken like somebody who's got a very large bank account role. No. <laughs> to me, it's like the better player argument's a weird, it's like the Jillian Gary argument from season one. Like, who should have, who deserved to win that? That season? one's a tricky one, though, because he came back so late in the game. Like, he left in, like, top eight and came back in, like, top four. Like, it was, that was crazy. But he was a target the whole time. Yeah, he was, yeah. From day one. But he skipped, like, the most pivotal part of the game, you know what I mean? But that's the argument. Like, he was yeah. a target from day one. Jillian yeah. really wasn't yeah. as much till later. Yeah. And then Gary won when it counted. Yeah. Even though he skipped a big part of the season. When he got kicked out and then came back? Yeah. He was, like, top eight, and then he came back, like, top five or four. But he missed, like, the most pivotal part of the game, which is, like, the hardest part, I would argue, right? It's, like, the middle. through that. Yeah. Middle part? Like, from, like, even in this game, you'd say, like, from here? Like, from here on in until top five? Like, this is, like, the nitty-gritty, right? Yeah, and that's then, true. You know. But. What would you rather have? Second place or third? In that situation? I don't know. It's, it's a tough question. I would have to, like, look at the scenario. I think, like... I want the 20K. Fuck it. Me. Yeah, same. Because I'll take the 20K and still be proud. Literally. Yeah. Hell yeah. The game I play, even if I float it through. Yeah. It's like asking an Olympic gold medal if they want, like, a bronze or silver. So even if it's, like, 7-0, you lose 7-0, you still take it? Yes. Yeah, I feel... You feel a little bit... Like, you feel some type of way about Of course. You're going to be a little, like... Okay, so take, take the 20... Okay, take the 20K out of the equation now. Second place gets nothing. Only first place gets money. Would you rather be evicted in third? Yeah. Okay. I guess that's what I was asking then. So forget the money then. Okay. No yeah. money? Yeah, sure. That's an of course. I was the better player. Yeah. 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 Nobody knows okay. it. Okay. Yeah. Cool. There it is. There I it agree. Is. I thought second got nothing. I actually just found oh, yeah. that out. Really? Ooh, yeah. We still don't know what we're playing for, right? Literally. That's actually true. Yeah. Wait, oh, we know it's 100K, but that's it. Yeah. You guys, you guys think second should get more? Yeah. 25 would be better. 25. Yeah, I think 25 yeah, is a good five. number. Yeah. 20, 20 is a little light. Yeah. One four. Because of like U.S. Obviously, the U.S. has buckets and more money, but yeah. like they're 500k and 50k. Would you take 15 and leave today? 15? Yeah. 15 to yeah. leave today? If they're like, you can have 15 thousand dollars and leave. Oof. Uh, That's uh no. I don't yeah. Think. The experience is too late. Yeah, I was gonna yeah. say I would have FOMO, so no. Yeah, we only have. Yeah, yeah FOMO. Right. I, I would have... take 30 and leave today. Y'all would it? Probably I'd not. Probably take thirty. <laughs> I'd take thirty. We all leave. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have really would struggled, you? but thirty k would change my life. Yeah, same. <laughs> same. I've never had like more than four thousand. Good part of the experience, at mm -hmm. least this far. Like when I think about like Julie or Josh mm -hmm. or even mm -hmm. LT. Thirty k, I could I could start my get, my food, had a full food catering. I would be yeah, good. but I don't like. I feel like as the further we get, we just see more. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. Still haven't seen well, Marsha. I think, I think we're at a really good point in the game because we're the all halfway now at this point. Huh? Halfway is like a good accomplishment. The moves. Yeah. The moves. All of us are here until day forty-one. Yes. Uh! What's that? Have you ever seen the show? Honestly, Beth might have seen Marsha. How do you not know who Marsha is? Could have been Beth. Oh, I guess that's true. Yeah, she'll just pop out of nowhere one day. Like, one day she'll just pop out of the wall, and she'll well, be like... I don't like, think she'll come in anymore, but it would be on a screen. It's, it's like a... It's not a real... Oh, you know what they might do is they might do, like, a Zoom Marsha. Yeah, on the yeah. Expedia. Oh, on that one, Wait, yeah. Marsha was actually a full person? No, no, no it, was like, it, was like it was like a head. moose head on the wall. Yeah, yeah. a moose head. But they oh. might do like the last virtual season. one to play with All the theme. Them. It was Every there last season. year? Yeah, I'm sure. Well, wait, no, season eight, I don't know. I don't remember if I've seen it season eight. No, they didn't get it that far. I don't remember either. Yeah, seven. Yeah, Marsha! I have no idea what you're talking about. Jed does a good impression. Do you know Trevor Boris? Yeah. They went every single week? Yeah, every single week. Everyone's like, cool. Cool, you earned it. Good job. I'm like, yeah, ninth time. Good job. Yeah, nah, ninth letter. <laughs> that would be savage. I really like the invisible clip. You're right. That would be dope if they. Yeah. I think they might. It would be funner to watch from home. Oh, yeah. We are hit. <laughs> Can confirm. <laughs> Can confirm. <laughs> Because you can see everybody can't, they, they don't know who it is. They're all just campaigning to each other. Mm -hmm. It's actually psycho. <laughs> 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 Dang.
Dude, I don't even care anymore. <laughs> everyone thinks it's me. It's like there's no way it's hey, me. Hey, listen, everyone really thought it was me. Everyone thought it was me until I said about the block. Everyone's like, I know it's you, Brayden. Just say it to you. <laughs> Just say it to you, Brayden. It's okay. I know. After the have not like you really put yourself on slop. And I was like, I did not. Cold. I swear. That's and everyone's like, mm-hmm. I remember Vic was like, Brayden, I don't believe you yet. Ah! Yeah, you're a little sus still. You're a little sus. Oh, sorry. I don't even care that people think it's me. It's I like, still don't believe it's it, not like, you. You're like, I won't go home next to Austin. It's Austin, did you imagine? <laughs> you guys are savage out with me. You didn't say that. No. Uh, no, like, no, like that's like I was invisible HOH and I was yeah. like, I, there's no way I would go home. That's That hilarious. would be savage. Oh my Yourself God. on the block, knowing that you'd be all right. You don't be all right. <gasps> mm -hmm. I'm this laundry in a bit. That's my favorite pastime. What do you do? What? Some laundry. <laughs> folding and laundry? Some folding and laundry. I don't do it like this at home. Like, I'm not a crazy psycho. <laughs> <fucking laundry. laughs> I just don't know what to do. That's like a task that will take time. Uh huh. No, literally. They're like just taking down the booths now. Yeah. What's going on? That should have been pretty quick. There's like nothing back there except for the booth. Yeah, so I was so confused. I was like, that's literally all that's here. <laughs> There's a bench and <laughs> nine booths. Hi. Yo. Can I wear your green patch shirt? Huh? Can I wear your green patch shirt? Yeah, you know where to find it? No. Your bag? No, I, I don't know. Might be in the drawer. A drawer? I saw yeah, Do you mind if I look? The little yeah, drawers open in the... I took them, yeah. Oh, you got them? Yeah, I moved my stuff uh, last night. Didn't know. Didn't yep, know. I'm all situated. <laughs> all moved in. I got, no, I got two big drawers, too. They're just yeah? like, they're random. Okay. They're nice. just random. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah. Actually, Did you I'm move into drawers, too, Beck? Huh? Did you move into drawers, too? I, ha I have, like, two. Like, I don't use them, though. I like uh, my stuff out. But, like, yeah, I grabbed a few just to put random shit in. There. I'm going to reorganize my bag today. I haven't yeah, done it yet. I'm going to reorganize. I got so much shit, shit I haven't everywhere. used yet. Everywhere. With all these products I brought, and I'm like, why did I bring this? Do you have a lot of clothes you haven't worn? Too? Not a lot, but definitely still some I haven't worn. Mostly stuff for Thursdays, like fancier stuff. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I have a whole bunch of jeans I haven't worn. They're just folded in the exact same spot since I got here, but I'm like, they're jeans. Like, yeah. But most of my tops, I'm almost through. Oh, oh no. no. And they told me I wouldn't wear it all. Really? Yes. I was like, do you know me? I will wear it all. So, like, I don't think. And you're like, bet. I wear every single item, almost. Sport. My jewelry, like, everything. Come on. Yeah. You've had a, quite a few iconic outfits. Oh, easily. What? Stop. Uh, she's like, go on. <laughs> I know, but yeah. And a lot of like, I had to, I had to bring stuff that were not with any writing and stuff. So that was right. Like, hard. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's like literally everything. Everything. Who makes this? Huh? Uh, what do you mean? He's like a local you artist, right? Local, like, how did, like. Yeah, that's a local artist from Hanagua. He's actually a world-renowned artist. That designed right? this? Yeah. yeah. That's what he was saying. And then he's the one that sells these? No, he made those for my nephew's basketball team. They're the, these? Yeah. They use it as like a fundraiser. I bought I bought three of them. That's dope. I didn't even notice this. <laughs> Rider Raiders basketball. Yeah. yeah. That's dope. I love yeah. this. So my dope. nephew's a, he's just like, he's got potential. Potential. How old is he? The one? He's different. Yeah, he turned yesterday? 14 yesterday. The one you shot it up? Yeah. You did it? Yeah, Sad. I did it, yeah. Anyways? Sad. Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> Sad. <laughs> of course. Like, no shout out. Keep us like, can I get a shout out? I have it. You see it every season. Why are they going to come down so hard on us? Like, I love his style of art. Like, everyone's got their own flavor. And I just love the way that he puts it together. His name's Jay Bellis. Jay, what up? Oh, shout out. Yeah, he's young, too. He's like 20... Eight? Twenty nine? Oh. Young guy. Your nephew's in Terrace or in Haida? He's on Haida Gwai. On Haida Gwai? Oh. Yeah. How often do you go back over there? As much as possible. But not since coronavirus. It'll be two years this August since I stepped home uh, stepped foot on the motherland. Longest I've ever been in my life. Mm. Oh. Cause you gotta do two weeks of self isolation before you could do anything. Yeah. Like yeah, if yeah. I were to go home. So I'd have to like stay like out in a cabin on the beach or something. For two weeks by myself, no cell service. Yeah, wait. 
and I barely lasted before the house. Barely. <laughs> you guys. I got she you. takes one for the team. She really I does. She care. really does. I got you guys. Take your time getting up. I got you. It got real aggressive real quick this morning. So I was like, house oh. guests, get up. Literally, I, I like, know. I was like, I just did the fucking battery change. How mad were you? So mad. I go in there slamming. Stop, really? Yes. Slam the thing, I grab it, I come back, don't say a word, I slam it in there. Oh my God. I swear to God, I almost broke the thing. Like, because I ripped it out so hard, it almost ripped off the whole thing. They gotta fucking... quit you like that. No more morning batteries. <laughs> the door falls off. Set ass. Not a peep. Not, not a peep. They don't see no. that. They're just like. Yeah. Times in the BB can house. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna. I don't want to be looked at as if I've been shielded by the boys the whole time. I don't want that. I want to show what I'm playing outside of the guys. Like as of right now, like people just thought I was in the middle, and that's fine with me. But if, the thing is, like if if Ty and Jed are in jury, they will convince everybody. They will let everybody know how well I played this game. It's kind of important that they. My ideal final three would be me, Brayden, and Tina. Because I will win against those two. I don't want Tina to go anywhere. It was, I wish they would say jury. If they tell us that we're, if they tell us that this is the jury week, I'll get Ro out because Ro even said the person who gets me out, I will get my vote. So that would be a good thing to say. Like, he also has made it very clear, like he he's never he's never made it clear of where he stands. But I do know that he's going for Jed and Ty, which eventually means he's going for me. V is smart in this game. I need V. I still need V in this game. Brayden, I want to take to the end. I wouldn't mind sitting beside Brayden.
to say that they did. But I mean, what's my biggest thing is in this game is that I've had alliances with everybody. I was the actual glue that held me, Jen and I, together because I've been with them since the start. No one will go against us because I've had relationships with everybody in the house. Tara does nothing for my game. Absolutely nothing. She's going like I I don't I don't need I don't need to prove anything to you, Tara. She's been saying things that I need to prove loyalty. Why? Why do I need to prove loyalty to you? You've done nothing for me. And moving forward in this game, you probably won't. Plus she just sits here and complains all day about being here and I'm not about someone being ungrateful. Relationships are everything in this game, and I have them with mainly everybody. I have that down. Everybody loves me. Everybody trusts me. And that is my biggest thing right now. Everybody trusts me. With Ro, I could just say, hey, Bob, bro, bro, like, I've come to you quite a few times. He has never approached me. And I did say that to him the other day. Ro has never approached me. He wants to do this final floor thing with Jed and Ty. He wants to work with me moving forward. Well, it involves a little bit more work. He can put any work into our relationship. But on the chance that he doesn't go home this week and he wins veto, I need to protect me, Jed and Ty, that way. Or say, yo,
is. I don't want, I'm not taking Tara. I'm not taking Tara. She's useless. I'm taking Ro. Let's just pretend. Tara goes home this week. Someone takes out Ty next week. Someone takes out V on the double eviction. It's Beth, Kiefer, Rowan. Ro will always be a bigger threat than me. That's the thing. I know it's best for the boys game. And then if Ro does go home this week, it is okay, because then, if Ro does go up this week, Ro, if Ro and Tara, oh, okay, I just need to feed it to Ro, though. Brother's gonna ruin my game. I don't even really want to talk out loud. Talk in the diary.
today? Thanks, brothers. Ow. Ow. Like a rock. Whoa. <laughs> like a rock. I'm praying and hoping. I heard a little. And then we heard a. Oh my gosh. I don't know who's gonna be in my bed. I don't know who's gonna be on it. On what? The bed. Oh, bed. Oh, I think they thought you said bed. I think it was a row. I think what? Everyone's like, probably saying, get him like, what? No. That's what I said. I was like, no. Why did I say Jed? I was like, <laughs> with him after. Yeah. I didn't even think of Jed. Like, I don't even know, like, if I would, well, obviously, I wouldn't rather go up, but it's at the same time, it's like, fuck, I want a chance to play. Well, that's my thing right now. Like, do I just want to go up? You but know like, what I mean? Yeah, but it's like, is that the stupidest thing of all time? <laughs> you know? It's one or the other. It's either smart or dumb. Yeah, but at the same time, at the end of the day, it's not like I really have a choice. Like, she's going to do what she wants to do. So if like, if I go up there and I'm just like, don't put me up, and she puts me up anyway, I might as well go in. And if I have a strong feeling that she's gonna put me up, I might as well just go in and just be like, put me up. But yeah, I don't know what she's thinking right now. So gonna have to go get in her head a little bit and see what's up. Yeah, I think, oh. yeah. We can try and like say similar things, but not where it's to the point where it's obvious, but to the point yeah. where she's like true. Yeah. So take me through quickly like what you're planning to say. I'm just going to be like, hey girl, like, <laughs> um, I know we haven't talked a lot of game, yeah. but I just wanted to come in here and say, I think, you know, whoever was the Invisible HOH last week made a good move, separated a big duo to prevent, you know, these doubles going to jury. Yeah. And I don't know if you've noticed, but there's some people in this house that I believe are just kind of floating by. Yeah. Um, I don't know if you already have a plan. Like, I'm just going to make it very, like, you know, but I just thought I'd come in here and let you know what I would do. Right. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe I won't say that. No, don't say that. Very, yeah. But I'll just be like, I thought I'd come in here and just let you know, like, where I would vote. Like, where would I, like, I don't even know. Fuck. I feel like, hopefully it'll be organic. Yeah. But just, like... I don't know. Like, and like, I don't know. It's hard because I, like, I fucking fuck with them, you know? Yeah. For sure. Um, but at the end of the day. This is Big Brother. If I go or you go this week. No, that can't happen. There's a very strong chance that one of the three wins. I mean, that's just how it's going to be. You know? Yeah. If I go or you go. I mean, Tina and Tara are just gonna get steamrolled. I think. I don't know what Keeper's gonna do. I th I think she would be open. I I'm not comfortable saying this, and I wish I was because it just yeah. makes me sound like a pussy. Yeah. But I don't think she would be against hearing that you're willing to take that shot, because, um, Austin was pitching that. Yeah. And when I was in the shower, Beth was telling me how she liked it. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like she was like, you know. She's like, I actually considered it for a moment. Yeah. At the same time, she's been like all over the place. So I, she could just be saying that. Yeah. And not really worth considering it, but. Like she's so far deep with them now that she'll never be able to take that shot. Well, she sleeps with one of them now. You know what I mean? Like he's in the HOH room. That's so done. it's like, do you really want to take a shot at it? That's why I'm just like, Beth, like, what do you want to do in this game? Are you here for the experience or are you here to win? Exactly. I think that's a question that Quite frankly, she has to answer. That's a good way. Because there's almost no scenario 
where she goes with those two to the end and wins. No, there's no Well, way. there is no scenario. There's no, like, that's literally impossible. And that's not like me going up to her and BSing her. Like, that's true. Like, if I were in jury and she's sitting next to one of them two, I'm probably voting for one of them two. I am voting for one of them. <laughs> I know you never, <laughs> you never vote for I would not. <laughs> like, I would not. I don't think there's anyone she could be. Yeah. That I would vote um, And that's, that's true, but like, especially against them two, you know what I mean? Yeah. So I'm just hoping that she understands that. Uh. Quite frankly, like Jed's Jed's the bigger threat. He's positioned himself quite nicely. Do you agree over Tishan though? Oh yeah, I do agree. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, he's just, he's a triple threat in my eyes. I think the thing is they feed so well off each other that you cut one of them off, preferably one of the boys. That's like, that's like how they become weaker. Otherwise they can just win back to back to back to back to back to back to and then they go all the way. And the fact that Beth won this one means like they get to compete in the next one. <sighs> and if the next one is physical, cause like we've been expecting physical for like three, four weeks now, like. But that's actually really fucking... I don't even like to think about that. Like, they both can play next to me. Yeah. So if I go this week... If I go this week and they win... I'm gone. You and Brayden are probably the next two biggest. You and Brayden would probably be the noms, I guess, next week if I go. I want, if I go, I want you and Brayden to win this game. Like, I want one of you two to. I don't even want to hear you say that. You're not huh? going anywhere. You're fucking. So that's why I hope it's jury, because if it's jury, then I have a vote. Yep. Um, and there's the POV. We can't forget about that POV. Yeah, look, I've won back. I've won. That's why I'm like, do I want to just, depending on what she's thinking, right? If she doesn't want to get me out, then. Maybe I don't ask to be put up, but <laughs> if it's, the thing is, if it's Tina or Tara, if it's Tina and Tara on the block together, it for sure looks like a backdoor for one of me or you, you know? Yeah. There's no way they're going to try to get Tina and Tara out right now. I mean, we can go and pitch that, but, and say some things, but if it's both of them on the block, I think it's a backdoor for either me or you. Let's not turn on each other. No, I'm specifically telling you right now, like, you know, I could easily go in the room. If I was like really like individually focused, I could easily go in there and say, Vic did this and Vic did that. But I'm telling you right now, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. Because I no told way. you, I told you I wouldn't drag your name again and try to get you up there like I did just to save Kyle. Yeah. So I'm not going to go in there and do that. And I'm being honest with you right now. I'm no way in hell am I doing if that. If she asks me questions, I'm going to be vague about it. But... If we can help each other out in this situation, it's gonna be so much better. That's the plan. Because at the end of the day, for us to build a resistance, like, I'm not, to be honest, I'm not super close to Brayden. I was closer to Austin, as you could probably tell. But from a strong point perspective. Has a heartbeat right now? You guys said my ass was twitching last night too. It was. It was, Wait, on there? It was twerking. <laughs> Bands to make her dance. Right? You seen that though, right? Yeah, it was going. Like that. Like that. Do you, oh! Do you oh! My, is it actually moving? Yeah, yeah. like yes. it's going nuts right now. I just do this thing with my leg where my leg shakes. I don't know my ass. Your leg, your leg is out. not moving. It's just your butt. Like this. Mm. ADHD thing. Yeah, your legs are not moving at all. It's just your ass. Shake <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> it like, like a Polaroid sleep. picture. Hmm? Let's shake it like a Polaroid picture. <laughs> Mm. Just, they've been coming after me since week two. That's why I needed to try so hard to save Kyle, right? Because that would have been, you know, at the end of the day, Kyle was like my close ally, but he was also protection at the same time for me. I wanted Kyle to stay. I even pushed for it. Yeah. I did. Yeah, I mean, there was a chance he still stayed even after Austin went up too, so. Like, I mean, after Austin went up is when I pushed for it. Oh, right. Not when you were up there. 
Come on, Rob. And like, who knows? Like, even if, if I was against Kyle in in week when he went home, I think I would have gone. You think yeah. so? I think yeah. I think they wanted me gone. So like, I had to win that veto to stay in this game. I didn't have to win the veto last week, honestly, but I did. I'm glad you did. I think no matter who won the veto, like if you won, if I won, Austin or Braden won, or even Tashawn won, one of them was going to go anyway. Yeah. So it really didn't matter. I agree. I agree with that. Ugh. Oh, bad. It's just like fuck, because you know the boys are going to be in her ear like crazy. In her ear? Yeah. Well, yeah. And that's, that's what I was saying earlier, is like, does Beth want to play this game to win? Because I don't, if she tries to get me or you out right now, I don't think she's playing to win. And like selfishly too, like same thing. If you go this week, then I immediately become the next biggest target. If I'm not already. Yeah. So that's not good for me. At the end of the day, if it's you or I against one of these two on the block, you know, it, come, it kind of comes down to keeper. That's why I'm not like, it depends how he votes, right? Yeah. Oh, man. My brain can't handle all this. Huh? I said my brain. My brain is not fit for this type of thing. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to approach it. All I know is if one of us two goes, it immediately makes the other weaker. Absolutely. And I'm going to try my kidding? best to avoid that. That's the thing. Me, you, Brayden, and the girls, like, that's five against three. Yeah. Or, f I guess, four. And we all know who's, we're all taking a shot. Boy, 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 boy. I wanted to say, like, in, in a veto situation, I don't know who's going up, but, like, let's say you went up and I won the veto. Yeah. I just want you to know that I would use it. I know that last week I fucking yeah. didn't, said I wouldn't for Austin and stuff, but yeah. one thing I've been consistent about is yeah. how important it is how you grew up so close to me, yeah. and that would be my thing. Like, I can't do this to my city. Like, you know what I mean? I feel like yeah. I have that mm -hmm. to, like, you know? I mean, I hope that's the case. Yeah, that would be because I would, best case I would scenario. if I if I was in that situation. That would be best case scenario. Then we're both safe for the week. Would you honestly? Yes, I would. I would. I'm not close enough with them, like to not. Like, do you know what I mean? I mean, I I think it's in the best interest of your game. I haven't won a veto yet, and also I would be like, I won this veto. I fucking yeah. worked for it. I'm using it. Sorry. Like you know. Because I mean, Braden Braden would never go up anyway. So then, if he did use it in that situation, it would be Tina Tara on the block. 
and one of them would go, and we could just pick which beverage is best for our game. Exactly. I no, think, honestly, I, I think that would be the smartest for your game, and it would be the smartest if I did that as well. I would. I know they're coming for me very If you're soon. not, like, if you're honestly telling me that you'd do that. I am being honest. Okay. I'm being very honest. I would very well use it. And it's not me. Obviously, I don't like questioning people when they tell me things, but, like, obviously, well, it's this, a fucked up, this game that's a f is, like, obviously, fucks you up a little bit, and you, like, you have to question everything, so. You have to. If you're honestly telling me that. At this point in the game, I would absolutely use it. It's, done, it's, it's, it's time for it to be used and to okay. start creating some drama. Okay. Not creating drama, but they will go all the way unless they're stopped. Okay. Yeah, I would use it. I would use it as well, honestly. I would use it. I'd be like, I'm not doing that to my Hamilton buddy. I don't, you guys are fucking, look at you guys. You're the power trio. I worked hard for this veto. It's I'm just like, it. what's the best chance of a resistance, right? Like, me, you, and Brayden need to be in this game. Because he, obviously he gets like super close to Beth. But yeah. I think that, I don't know. I think that we could use him. I think so too. Over... You know, Tina and Tara, obviously, if they win an HOH, they'd take a shot, but they'd be, like, more scared to do so. And, like, again, you're going to have to, like, keep me in the loop on Keeper, because Keeper, I, I just don't know how to read him. Yeah. So, and obviously, we had our whole situation earlier yeah. in the game, so. Yeah. He tells um, me he wants me here. Yeah, because you can take a shot that he can't, just like that. Well, exactly. Um, with Brayden, like, before the vote. Yeah. Like, I literally was like, I need to know, like, are you willing to take the shot? Because I know that Austin is, and yeah. that's a big thing for me. Yeah. And he's like, Vic, absolutely. Like, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. So hearing him be so serious about it, I feel like I would call his ass out. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Like, if he said, like, if he ever had the power to and didn't. I th he would. Yeah. Like, it's at the point where we will lose this game. Like, when you uh, won the veto, did they, like... I know, I met, like, I said my piece to you, but, like, did they, like, fucking come for you? Uh, who? Like, the, the trio? Yeah, like, they basically... They basically came to me, and... They were, like... Okay, tell me honestly if they did this to you, too, but... Okay, I will. They tried to form a four-person alliance with me, and... Yeah. They did not do that with me. I'm so, telling you right now. Huh? They did not do that with me. So basically, and this does not. If this gets out, honestly, I'm fucked. So. Rohan, I will not yeah. tell anybody. Okay. So they basically did that, and then they were like, "So I wouldn't use the veto. I never would have used the veto anyway." But. But some security with them. Yes. So, but it's not like it's gonna matter because I think I'm going off anyway. So. That's why I don't really care to then use that. Be like, be like, the only reason I didn't fucking use it is because yeah. you guys guaranteed me safety. Yeah. Canada's watching. Yeah. Use that. Yeah. That's crazy. No, they did not say that to me. So, uh, so basically, they really didn't want me to use the veto in that situation. So I didn't. But um, and it wasn't because of them. You know what I mean? I didn't use it because of them. I just felt like no matter what I did with the veto. Austin or Braden would be going home. So if I, even if I use it on Austin and somebody else went up, Braden Absolutely. would still go. Um, Cause like everyone was looking to split up that pair anyway. So it's like, why would I use it and put you at risk and put Tina and Tara at risk and put Kiefer at risk of going up or whoever. Um, and then make like, you know, I'd rather have three people coming after me than fucking eight. Yeah, of course. You know what I mean? So that's, just, that's what the sitch was for sure. It was just never smart for me to use it. So it's not like them coming to me and telling. And that's what I hate about this is it looks like I'm just doing what they want me to do. I hate that too. And it's just coming off that way. But just in the moment, it was the best game move that I could have made because it would have put everybody at risk. Just use it to your advantage Invisible. though. If I knew who the HOH was, then it would change things, right? But I did Obviously didn't. Ty. Huh? It was Ty. Rohan, please go to the diary room. So, I truly believe it was Ty. I mean, I hope so. I mean, that's the only thing that was get me to sleep at night is that he was the one doing it. So, I just don't think anything else would make sense from a game perspective. It was best for their game to split up the couple. So and I expected stupid. if anyone on our side won it, then the two would be two up. Two boys, so. yeah, hell yeah. I feel like that was a fucking shot wasted. Unless obviously if it was Ty. Yeah. 
But. So, yeah, I'm just gonna. Just don't worry. I just don't want you to think I'm gonna go in there because I'm not. That's not the game I want to play. Okay. Promise. Okay. Because I'm I'm not going in there and I'm not dragging your name. I'm not. I'm just it's... giving her cases as why I should be here, but I'm not saying. Me that. too. Because really, big like in this situation, if we're looking at it realistically, my best chance of staying in this game is if I go in there and I pitch you. And I'm telling you that I'm not gonna do that because I did that before with Kyle. So Kyle would stay in the game. My best chance of staying in this game is for her to target you. Straight up. And your best chance is for her to target me. But I'm not gonna no. go in and do that. So I'm not gonna do I that. hope, I hope not. I hope I can I trust promise. you in the situation. And I hope if either one of us uses the uh, gets the veto and it's like me and Tara or you and Tara on the block, that we can use it. I will fucking Because that would be it. in the best interest of our game. Yes, I'm a super fan of this game and I wanna play it. Okay. All right. Okay. Well I'll be back after DR maybe. Okay. I'll yeah. be here, probably. <laughs> This game is crazy, but I'm here for it. I was born for this. Bow, bow. I was literally born for this game, I think. I got some cute shirts I haven't worn yet. Then we had a party, but she got food poisoning from the party. That's right. Then, her last day, she, uh, what's could, it called? Can't even have a nice last night because she's getting a woken up every hour. For an HOH she can't compete in. For an HOH, she knows she's not going to compete in. And they did her dirty in that too, and meeting in Arissa. Thing, she even got done dirty because they forgot her birthday. And her month was her meeting Arissa outside, holding her black bag. Like, she really got fucked. <laughs> like, it wasn't a good time. Yeah, they're cool. That's that what I'm saying, this game.